Hey guys, um, it's Kian, and, uh, I know I'm kind of cheating right now on this iPhone channel, iPod Touch channel, whatever, um, using my computer's camera, but, um, it's for the sake of me wanting to show you something that I can do on my iPod that could help a lot of you who own the iPod Touch 4th generation, the iPad 2, or even the iPhone 4, but really, the iPhone 4 really has no use for this, um, and it's how to film in low-light situations, um, and illuminate what's going on. So right now I'm going to show you that because I haven't really seen anyone else on YouTube make a tutorial about this. So I figured I could be the first. So the first thing you want to do is go into settings. And make sure that your brightness is up all the way. Oh, try that again. There we go. Then what you do is exit brightness and go to general. Scroll all the way down until you see accessibility. Right there. Oh, no. I clicked the wrong one. Accessibility. And then you see there's like all these options right here. Voice over, zoom, large text, button on black. What you want to do is you see this option down here that says triple click home. Uh, go there. And choose the one that says ask. So basically what it means is whenever you triple tap the home button like this, one, two, three, it brings up this little menu. You can either turn voiceover on, which I really don't recommend. You can turn the zoom on, which I also I really don't recommend. But for this tutorial, what you want to do is turn white on black on. And basically what white on black does is it inverts your screen's colors. So look, everything's all distorted now, all the colors are warped. But um, that's a good thing because you want this for this tutorial. So what you're going to do is go to your camera. Um, I have a passcode on my camera. Um, so what you do is go into your camera. Make sure you are using the front facing camera. So see, look, like all the colors are warped. But don't worry, this won't affect your video at all. And um, what you do is, say you're in a low light situation. I'm going to turn off these lights and I'm going to film a test clip. Hey guys, it's Kian, and I'm right now I'm showing you this little idea that I came up with of using your iPod's screen as a LED light on the front-facing camera um, by inverting the screen's colors in a low-light situation. So now I'm going to show you around a bit. Um, look, this is my my desk of stuff. This is my computer. My wall. And um, over there is my TV and my Wii. My dresser, my bed, there's my chair, there's my arm, and um, now I'm going to stop recording. And so there you have it, all you iPod Touch 4th generation and iPad 2 users who have wanted to film in low light but just couldn't illuminate it, uh, you can now do so with this little idea that I gave you. Um, also, this idea works great for photos with your front-facing camera, so you can pretty much do the same thing, but in picture mode, and uh, it takes the picture with sort of like a, an LED flash kind of feel, but um, it's not exactly, but it does work, it does illuminate the photo, while it doesn't do it amazingly, it's as good as it gets, and uh, it's, it's decent, and I, I'm glad that I figured this out, um, I think, if someone else already came up with this, please let me know, and also, be sure to, if you can, if you want to, you can make a video using this idea or take pictures using this idea and send them my way via YouTube message or video response and um, I'll see how it came out for you because um, I want to see if this idea is benefiting any of my viewers because that's mainly what I made this for. I wanted to help out a lot of the iPod Touch and iPad 2 users who are or aren't my viewers. Either way, I think this is a really cool idea and a lot more people should use this. So um, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to go and edit and upload this because it is almost 2 in the morning and uh, I can't sleep. Bye-bye.